Mountains. Well, it's 50 for Ollie Pope, who played beautifully late last evening. It's gone through everything, that's gone for four buys. Get low. Three figures for England, 102 for four. That's a further example of the seam movement that Mohamed Abbas gets as well. Pope oh. has played that one well. That's my point. That's a beautiful drive. Don't think it'll go away for four. They'll have to run three. a little bit better for this one. Full. Yesterday is a real <laughs> Width and dealt with Barley Pope. He just stands and marks his guard, doesn't need to run. That's a gorgeous shot. Quite gave him the width. I think there was 17 runs in that first hour. And we had a boundary in the first over after the break plus seven here, so we've got 11 runs in the first 1.5 overs after that break. Pressure's off, but I just think it's time for a bit of spin, Wardy. Old Trafford. 
the temperature is for a scorcher up here, or it is. We'll take it. Tries to catch it, but it's squirted through point. That will run away. to find some fluency. He's had to battle really hard. First hour, there was nothing on offer this morning from Pakistan, but just perhaps in the last 15 minutes, one or two scoring opportunities have presented themselves. Well, that's what test match batting is all about. When things are tough... Well done, Joss Butler, who survives to lunch. England won 59 for five. And it has been a battle. It has not been easy batting out there at all. Not that the pitch has been offering a great deal, but the Pakistani bowlers have bowled very well. Sony Live. We live to entertain. Download the app. Hello everybody and thanks for joining us. We are all set for the first day of the cricket summer in South Africa. It is the first Sunfoil test. It is obviously South Africa versus Bangladesh. Yes. Nicely played. No one down there. Good work from uh, Dean Nurga. I don't think he wanted it to go for six, but he'll certainly bank that. No one down there, no protection whatsoever, so why not play that shot? Good stuff from Elga. That's a safe shot. The men up on the leg side. Ball angled down. All they had to do was get a bit of bat in it. I'm with you. I don't think he meant it to go that far, but uh, the ball travels, yeah. And that's good batting, Dean Elga. He knew it was a low risk shot, especially with the ball angling down the leg side. <laughs> Didn't quite get all of it. A little bit of a top edge, but he'll be happy with that. Beautifully played. Use of the feet gets to the pitch, and that's Dean Elgar's second six of the day. Plays that shot well. Dean Elgar picked the right delivery as well. He didn't try and overhit the ball. The footwork was uh, precise, and the timing was beautiful. Play, 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 play. 